Hi babes, welcome back to another video of my channel. Excuse my nails. I know they're really damaged and like chipped. Hi, really quick. <laughs> really quick. Okay, shout out to Alexandra. I'm Olivia subscriber and I'm looking forward to the next video. Shout out. <laughs> shout out to Mother Sohyun. Can I have shout out for treating you, Vivi? And then shout out to Dai. Shout out, please. Got you guys. Okay, you're welcome. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, today I'm gonna store photo cards. Kind of like, I, I should be doing homework right now, honestly. But I'm kind of in like, um... I'm having withdrawals. Is that the right? I don't know. <laughs> like, I had a call with Levolution again last night and I'm just missing them. So I'm like, you know what? I have Levolution's photo cards completed. I might as well store them. Also, let me preface something. This is very important. So please listen so that my words don't get mis misconstrued, okay? Not one time on my channel have I ever talked negatively about any idol or group. Any time I've ever criticized anything, it has always been on the company or people in management. So let's not say that I'm hating on groups, okay? Thank you very much. One of my last videos, the like most obnoxious fucking people must have watched that video because I got the most like deranged comments of people who clearly did not listen to shit I said at all. Like if you have like, if you want to criticize my video, that's totally fine. If you don't like me, that's totally fine. But don't accuse me of something that did not happen, just like straight up. I thought I was going crazy because I rewatched my own video and sure enough, the fucking shit people said that I said in that video, I never said. So please just listen, okay? Okay, sorry for that rant. I just need to put that out there. Not one time will you catch me talking negatively about an idol or a group, okay? Okay. Um, there are plenty of idols and groups out there that I do not like, but I don't feel the need to share them with you guys because why the fuck would I do that? Anyway, we're gonna store cards. Um, in my, I think it was my last video, I downsized a lot. Um, and I actually downsized more that I didn't put in that video. And I specifically said that collection would not get downsized, and I lied. I downsized Luna, but not in the way you think. I'm still collecting OT12, okay? Um, but I did downsize um, my non-album collection. I think I'm only going to collect Jinsoul from now on. Anyway, I'm going to pick my cards that I'm going to store for this video, and then I'll sleeve them. Yeah. I don't really know what I want to store. Um, I don't know how many cards are in here either. I have so much shit. Let me pick everything and then I'll sleep it after, okay? Sorry, I'm back. Oh, fuck, shit, fuck me. Just kidding, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I'm so... Ah, this is a bad idea, hold on. Okay, sorry, I was separate. I was getting cards and then I also made a thumbnail picture really quick with them, so yeah. Let's just get into sleeving these, okay? Okay, anyway. These are the cards. I'm gonna, I need to get some white sleeves for some of these. Yeah, we have like a little, we got like a little bit of variety going on. So yeah, and then one of these already sleeved, this one. Um, but yeah, basically like, now that I got like my kind of disclaimer out of the way, I guess I could just talk about like whatever. Um, the only thing is when I film my videos, I've talked about this before, but when I film my videos, I usually film them, right? And then it's not until like, few weeks later or like a month later or months later that the videos that i film i actually like edit and upload right so i always forget what i talk about but i don't want to like repeat myself all the time but i'm like i'm never sure if i do or not because i always forget what i'm talking about but anyway updates i guess um i don't know if i talked about this but my top i have like my secured top four bias line in triple s um, which is as follows. Soyeon, there's a freaking thing on this random card. Soyeon, Shinwi, Yubin, and Hayden. They're my bias line in order. And then Lovelution is just like my unit, like my favorite unit. They're the unit I'm biased to. And then I honestly don't rank the other four members of the unit, nor the rest of Triple S. Yeah. My cat is being naughty. Um, just cause like, that's way too hard, I wanna, like, are you kidding? Oh my god, also, Triple S, the ballad is coming. I'm so fucking excited. By the time this video comes out, it's probably already out, though. So, whoops. Um, oh my god, also, I have a joy card. When do I ever have a joy card? I always forget what I talk about, so yeah. 
But yeah, Love Lucian is like my favorite subunit of Triple S. Might be biased because yesterday was my sixth time meeting them. So that's probably why they're my favorite unit. And I would love to meet Evolution, but I don't think it's going to happen, unfortunately. Which definitely sucks because I really do want to meet them, but yeah, probably not going to happen. Maybe after their, oh my god, I literally can't talk. Maybe after their tour, but I don't know. Um, and like depending on like this valid unit that they're creating right now, um, and that's going to be voted on soon. I'm very curious like if that will be like a physical release or if it will be a digital or like just whatever and if they'll do they'll probably do fan signs for that too what the hell is in the sleeve mama so yeah and hopefully if they do fan signs like i'll probably try for one just because like you guys know i love talking to triple s like Olivia. i guess i'm like becoming a little bit of like a video call pig but i don't know like i just really like talking to them and overall i feel like their fan signs are a little bit easier to get into than some of the other groups that i really like like I was actually considering trying for a Heejin though because her quota is like really low right now. So I might buy some Heejin albums and I'm like literally the worst Orbit because, or Udi, whatever, because I actually haven't bought Heejin's album yet. <laughs> and it's been out, which actually, um, I don't know if I talked about this either, but Heejin has my favorite like re-debut post Luna, which, oh my God, by the time this video comes out, it would have already been, but it's almost been a year since November 25th happened. If you were there, you know what happened. If you did not cry on November 25th, are you even a real Orbit? What a time. It's crazy that not even a year later, so many great things have happened since that like terrible thing. So I don't know. I'm just hoping like that, like I saw, you know, like that company is trying to get on the girls that left but hopefully like things just keep working out for luna um yeah i feel like i'm like so jumbled today like i didn't know what to talk about um what yo what the fuck do i talk about i don't know like what what do you guys like me talking about i like usually like i don't know i'm like in a weird mama this one has a crazy scratch on it um oh my god also i found a trade finally for one of my oec cards like my extra cherry that was damaged. I was actually going to trade it with somebody before, but they didn't like the damage, even though their card was pretty damaged too. So I don't know. Because like just the OAC cards were damaged in general. Hold on. Um, but yeah, to each their own. But I found a trade. So I'm either going to trade her for a different cherry that I need or a Kim Lip. I don't know. I kind of wanted to trade a Kim Lip because I... Um, Kim Lip is... The only one I have like the least amount of cards for her for version up. Um, and then I actually have Jinsoul completed. And then I'm only missing two cards for Teddy. I'm missing one that they offered. And then I'm missing her like pigtail outfit one. So I'm almost complete with her too. So I'm just missing, literally I'm missing like five Kim lip cards and then two Teddy cards. So maybe I'll trade for Teddy, I don't know. Um, I need to like go out and buy the last card I'm missing though. Because I need to work on... Lucemble and I need to work on Heejin um, and Chu. My actually, I have to, I forgot. I have Chu albums at my Korean address and I have to forward those because those are group order stuff too. But I was going to order Heejin's albums and also some like more evolution ones um, and I just never did. So those albums have just been sitting at my Korean address and I'm like scared to forward them because I'm like, oh my god, how much is it going to be like shipping? Because I'm going to split that among everybody, right? So I'm just like, oh, fuck, I don't know. But we'll see. Um, but oh my gosh, also funny, funny story. So when I had my call, hopefully this glare isn't like in my face the entire time. When I had my call yesterday, I swear, Lola, Lola. My cat is being so, anyway, when I had like, Whenever I have my calls, it's so weird, like, okay. So, like, the girls, like, they usually remember me, right? But I, like, I swear Shinwi's memory is so weird, because, like, oh, wait. Oh, my God. I have this card, by the way. I said I, I was going to double save it. Um, but, yeah, like, Shinwi, like, it's crazy. Like, she remembered me, like, she recognized me in person. Like, when I was in the, like, in the audience at the concert, right? Um, 
there's a hair in here too. I didn't even use these sleeves. Okay. Jesus. Also, I cannot believe I have this word. But yeah, and then like she memorized me like my our other calls. And in my last call, she said that we we're besties, right? Which, no delusion. I'm just saying that's like, you know. Because we talked so many times. But then yesterday, she was like, oh, it's nice to meet you. And I just laughed. Like, I was like, oh my goodness. I don't blame her though. Like, they meet so many people. It's actually crazy how like... I thought finally they would get rest, right? Cause like they, they're off tour and stuff. Bro, why might have still have them doing fan signs? Like, especially when Soyeon is gonna be on that like AI show. I'm like very much like, what the fuck? Um, also in my last video, when I downsized twice, I said I wasn't gonna collect any OT9 sets anymore. I did lie. I changed my mind. Cause I didn't like the look of like putting cards on the back for like eras that had more than nine. So yeah. Anyway, let me organize this into stacks. But also, if you're curious, no, I did not get, like, mad at Shinwi over that or anything. I would never. Um, I just thought it was funny. That's why I mentioned it. Also, I only have two Luna cards. Isn't that so sad? And we have Lusa or Artemis. Oh, my God. Um, and, like, for, like, Lucemble, I just have my pulls. I have my, like, I don't have everything in here. But, yeah, I have, like, my... You know my my QR pulls from the signed albums that I got from the tour, and then also my like just um, photo book album pulls, um, and then I wanna I think I'm gonna get like a separate page just for like, um, like pobs. Like I might just like I don't wanna collect pobs, but like I'll just keep like whatever I pull. I guess like if I pre-order from any stores, you know what I mean. So I don't know. I'm like not sure what I wanna do about that. We're gonna get started though. Um, also, I forgot what I was talking about, so, yeah. Okay, here we have my Bongu collection. I don't have anything for the new, like, the newer album. I know it's not really new anymore, but I don't have anything for that. Um, but for this, for one, I have this, like, D-Icon Bongu card. I'm trying to, like, not get my face so I don't have to fucking edit so much. But yeah, so I'm selling this for, like, 4 or $5. Or, I think it was 5 with the stamp, but anyway. Yeah, it has bone gear. It's pretty cute. And it does kind of like... I'm pretty sure these are from the same era. Like, if you look at his hair. So that's why I got it. Because I know that there's like the jewel case versions. But I always see those sold for really expensive. So I don't know if I want to get those. But yeah, I need to like find something to put here too. So yeah. Um, but that was it for bone gear actually. So yeah, pretty, pretty quick. But I don't know if I'll keep that card in there long. Because maybe I'll get the jewel case if I can find them cheaper for Thursday's Child. So I don't know. Er... Free, sorry, but I don't know. Okay, here is the next collection I have a binder that I have to store cards in, and it is for Velvet. I have one Joy card from Finale, um, and I have actually not ordered any of the Chill Kill albums yet. I'm trying to, like, I think I've talked about this before as well, but like, I don't really buy albums for like non ults anymore, but yeah, I have this one. I traded my um yeti scrapbook card for this joy this is actually like my favorite finale card too from joy so i also keep seeing myself in my collection but yeah i traded for this one um but yeah, i also haven't even set up for the chill kill album which i actually did like i don't really like chill kill the title track that much i thought it would just need time to like grow on me but i don't know if i'm really digging it that much but i do love the b-sides so yeah Oops. Anyway, we move on next. The next binder I have cards for is my OT12 Luna binder. I am worried that as this binder fills up, I will have to break it up because this binder is pretty full, but a lot of the pages in here are like pretty empty, you know? So I'm not sure, like, I don't really want to break it up. I kind of want to keep everything in the same binder. Um, I also have to change the layout. I, I think I talked about the layout already, though, how I changed it. I don't know. But I don't have anything until plus plus, so we can skip ahead to that. Also, I feel like my camera is like really... I don't know. Anyway, it's a little too... It's a little too far. Is that better-ish? I don't know. Anyway, for plus plus, I have Hyunjin's B version. I think I traded like an Espo card for this, um, but yeah, I'm just glad to have her done. This card's pretty cute. And these cards are like so hard to find. Also, I have 
I'm waiting for some to pack, but I think I have this Max and Match Jimsol on the way too. Oh, there's no sleeve in this binder. Um, but yeah, I have like a trade that I set up for this. So hopefully, yeah, I don't know. Some people I started setting up trades with, like they haven't packed yet or like they just haven't communicated when they want to send out yet. So that's why I'm just like waiting, but I have this Hyunjin, which is very exciting. So one card closer on plus plus, not that I have a lot anyway. Then we can just skip ahead to flip that, but as you can see, I changed the layout. So I did like Kijin, Hyunjin, Hustle, and then Yojin, Vivi, Kim Lip. Oh my god, also, I haven't taken this out yet, but I have this Vivi card <laughs> that I traded for. I just haven't taken this apart yet because I started putting my trade, like I started journaling my trades. Like I use like all the packing materials and like make a little spread in my journal. And I just haven't done that yet. So I haven't taken that out. I totally forgot about that card. Um, but yeah, we can skip out to flip that. Sorry. Um, but yeah, I don't really like this setup though. Like just like the white sleeves. I don't know how to like, I don't know how to make this any cuter. Also, this Kim Lip is pretty crooked. Hold on. I don't normally fix crooked cards, but that was like too crooked. It bothered me. Okay. So, yeah, let's just skip ahead. See, like, this would be so satisfying. Like, when I get this last Eve and when I get this last two, like, just fully complete. I don't know. But I also, and I did it like horizontal rows instead of like vertical. I think it just looks a little nicer. So, I don't know. But yeah, I don't have anything into the C version. And then I have like the hardest flip that card to get. Coffee Eve. I bought this card in like a bundle. So I did not spend like a lot of money on this card alone. I bought it with like pops and stuff, which I don't know if I'm going to keep them or not. Um, But yeah, I'm just happy to have this card like a little overhyped in my opinion. It's cute, but like... Is it $70 cute? I don't think so. But, you know, no shade to anybody who did spend that much money on this card. But yeah, one card down. It's crazy how I don't have a single chair for this page. But yeah, this is like the most exciting card of the video, I guess. Because it's fucking popular Luna card. <laughs> um, yeah, and there's actually another collection I want to start. A full group one. And they have a lot of popular cards like that too. So I'm kind of like hesitant. But we'll see if I collect them. You guys will know. But yeah, that was it for Luna. Next, we have my least favorite binder, just based off binder itself. It's my non album Soyeon binder. Yeah, mama, I need to get a new one so bad. I really want to get one of those macaron binders and then like decorate it with ribbons and shit. But I just have some pops. These are going to these are going to be out of order, okay? This is Love Lotion, Dear My Muse. Um, don't know what round this is from. I'm so sorry. But yeah, I just have this one. Pretty cute though and then i have this flnk or flink however you want to say pub this is from september 1st i remember that because this is from my order so pretty cute though also i finally got sucked in i finally bought her freaking from because um capitalism also though during my call yesterday with her i was like did you take pictures when you went to in and out and she's like yeah i did which by the way i was the one who freaking suggested for them to go in and out burger and they did crazy and she said she took pics and I was like, oh my god, can you post them in front of them? And she's like, yeah, I can. And then she never did. What the heck? But yeah, I have this pop next. I think this was like the first round of assemble, like from assemble. I think this was like make store. But it's like a lucky draw or something, I think. But it's really cute. But yeah, these are all out of order. I am so sorry. Like, the order of this binder is insane. Next, I have this Soundwave fan sign card. I don't remember if this is from the... I don't remember if this is from the video call fan sign. Or the in-person. I actually have the other one too. It's just not in this. I, it's still in my box. I'll sort in another video. Um, but yeah, I have this one too. Very cute though. And then that was that for my triple S like non-album stuff. I have this, Dear My Muse, Flink. I think this is Make Star. And then this one was from Soundwave. But I think this was, this was from like a long time ago. So yeah. Also I have like more of her Adam objects on the way i have like i think one or two more i don't remember fuck but yeah i'm like trying to start buying more for triple s um trying to work on this collection especially when they're constantly doing like new fan signs and events and stuff like i'm so behind on her stuff anyway next we have my non-album luna binder 
has nothing in it except for fillers so far. But we're gonna start off with Odd Eye Circle. Very exciting. I have four cards to store away today. First we have 207. I actually have Jinsoul's entire set done. I think I mentioned it earlier though. Yeah, I have Jinsoul's 207 to store. I believe I'm still missing Kim Lip for this one. I'm missing almost all of hers, unfortunately. So yeah, I have Jinsoul done. And then I have, or for that, and then for 210, I have like probably my favorite Jinsoul from the album. This card's really cute. So I have that to store. Very, very pretty. There's like a little air pocket. Oops, okay. And then I have for 212, I can't talk. I have Kim Lip. My sleeves are so dirty. But yeah, this one's pretty damaged. You can see she has like a line on her face and it's like the hollow. I don't know what happened. I don't know why Mod House changed like production companies or whatever because, man. But I don't think the evolution objects were damaged. I think they changed before that, so that's good. But yeah, that. And then for the clear cards, I have Chetty's. I think this is a small one. I don't know. But yeah, I have this one. And I just have that to store right here. And that's that on that for that. Okay. Next, we can move on. Next, I'm bringing out this binder again, but for twice. Um, I have, if you see any blank spots, those are cards I have on the way. But let me put these in order really quick. So the first card I have is for lane one. I have Dahyun's pink border. I'm still missing her yellow border. If you want to trade, I have a bunch of lane one or lane two cards on the way. Sorry, these this is lane two. So if you have her, if you have her yellow border and you want like, I have like a bunch of members up for trade, okay? So check if you're interested. Um, and then I also have this signal. I actually have her entire signal set I was able to trade for, which is really nice. But I have this blue border. And hold on, this one's like really crooked too. But yeah, I actually have her signal pose, which is so exciting, but that will be put away in like the next video or something. But yeah, that's just what I have for this. And then I did keep some of my OT9 sets. Like I kept this one, I kept this one. I didn't really change many of my OT9 sets actually. I think I kept the same exact ones. Also, I have this diamond on the way too, glitter border. I totally forgot about that. Next we have this OT9 set. I changed my OT9 set. I originally was gonna click the ring pop, but I decided to click the pink border. I can't talk because I feel like this one contrasts the most with her other ones. Like the black border doesn't contrast as bad, so I decided not to collect that one. Um, but yeah, for one, I have Jonghyun. And then I also have Chaeyoung. And then I think I have some more of these. And I have some on the way. I don't remember whose I have on the way, but I'm pretty sure to have Momo. So I'm gonna put this filler in Momo's spot. But that was out for this OT9 set. I have a bunch of twice cards on my page up for trade, so if you're interested, if you have anything I'm missing, definitely check. I have a ton posted. Okay? Okay. Well, I have this one on the way. Don't have any of her more and more cards on the way. And then I changed my OT9 set. Yeah, originally I was collecting the um, this set OT9, which I kept Jonghyun's because Daehyun is in the back here. It's really cute, so I put it on the back. But I changed to the Dunham set, so for the Dunham, I just have Tui, which I traded for. I have gotten so many trades done for twice. Like, downsizing really made me, like, care more about my twice collection. I think it was definitely, like, good for me to downsize. Because the amount of twice trades I've gotten in the past, like, few weeks is, like, the most I've probably gotten since dropping OT9. So, yeah. Pretty exciting stuff for me, at least. But we can move on to Lucemble next, which is back in my non-album little binder. Um, let's skip ahead to where this starts. I need to like, hold on. Okay, this is from the, the I think this is from the dream version. QR, wish, space, dream. And this is from the QR too. Okay. First, from the Wish version, let me actually, hold on. Let me put white fillers up here. 
Um, I decided also for like when Artemis has like their OT5 debut that I'm gonna do Artemis in the same exact layout because that's just easy. Also, let me move this Hyunjin filler down. But yeah, I'm still working on this album. I don't have a lot done. I do have, I think like two cards on the way. I don't know which ones though. Um, because I joined like a group order for like a Hyunjin pub. I, it was so cute, I couldn't help myself. But yeah, this is just my first pull. Um, I pulled this Hyunjin for the Wish version. I'm just gonna put her right here. This is the Wish version, right? This cream color. Yeah. Okay. And then next we have the dream version, which let me grab white sleeves for these as well. Um, and I don't know, like I talked about this before, but Hyunjin, like since before Audi Circle re -debut, like Hyunjin has been like bias wrecking me. And like, it kind of made me want to collect pops for her a little bit, but I still don't know what I'm gonna do. Like I do have Hyunjin pops and stuff. So I might just like, get a few here and there but first for the dream version i have this hyunjin this is the dream version right yeah this one i also pulled right now i just have my pulls on hand so yeah but fortunately because they did so many goddamn fan signs for this album which i think they're still doing fan signs um the cards are so 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 cheap so uh, i'm not too worried about collecting this era fortunately so yeah and then i also have this heiju which i pulled as well duh um, but this, this outfit specifically on her really reminds me of Midnight. I don't know if they did that, like, intentionally or if it was just, like, coincidence, but I love. Um, and then next we have the space version. Let me get fillers for this one. Anyway, for the space version, I just have one card, and it is a Heiju, which, say it with me, I pulled. But yeah, this one. Very cute. And then... Lastly, we have Ever Music. Mom, there's a thing in the sleeve. Okay. Yeah, lastly, we have Ever Music. Let me get sleeves again or fillers. I am like dropping everything on the floor. I don't know. Okay. And then for the Ever Music version, there are. Sorry, my dogs. Um, There's one card in each concept. So there's like Wish, Wish Dream Space. And then there's also um, like the QR ones, which I was like, okay, how am I gonna set those up? However, I figured out how I wanna set them up. First though, for the dream version, I have this go on. Okay. Um, so it'll be wish, dream, space. And then I'm gonna get another page. And I know I could just put like, I could just use these pages, but these ones I have set aside for Chu and Heejin. Oh my god. So I don't want to throw it off because then I'll forget to put a new page in. Okay. But yeah, we have the QRs and I just have Hyunjin. I'm just going to do a four pattern. Um, yeah, maybe I'll like, maybe I'll also make this like a pod page for this era. So maybe I'll do, maybe I'll put her in the first spot for now. Oh my god. Okay. How cute. My goodness. Okay, anyway, we move on to the last binder. Okay, last binder of cards for is Triple S. Um, I put my little wristband here from the tour because I forgot I still had it. Um, let me organize. Here we have Acid Angel from Asia, Levolution, Levolution, Acid Angel, Levolution, Levolution, Levolution. Okay. Not too much, okay. But, oh my god, also, okay, by the time this video comes out, um, I've hidden two of seven here. There's a freaking cat here. By the time this video comes out, Thanksgiving will have already passed, so if you're American, there you go. But um, I wanted to say, you know, just not to be too cheesy, but just things that I'm thankful for or grateful for this year. Um, once again, I'm very grateful for all of you who like care enough about my collection and stuff like I don't know how to like I don't know how to put into words but I'm just very grateful for all of you and for all the people that I've met in the community this year and stuff and anyone who's helped me on my collections whether it be trading or selling to me or gifting cards to me like I mean it, it means so much to me so I'm very grateful um 
And I'm also just, I guess, grateful for the groups that I am a fan of this year, I suppose. Um, wow. All my Ask Angel from Asia cards were just for this page. Um, but yeah, if you have this Naki or this Yuyan, let me know. But yeah, I just been, actually, wait. I think I have one of these Yuyans, so I don't know. Anyway, um, what was I going to say? <laughs> but yeah, I'm just so grateful for everything this year. And, um, the fuck is this page for? Oh, sorry. My mind, like, I can't do multiple things at once. Um, yeah, I don't know. I just want to say that I'm grateful for you guys. Like I said, I'm just not good at putting things, like, into words. But I genuinely am. So, yeah, and like, for example, like, I'm very grateful for, you know, Triple S this year and for all the chances that I had to, you know, interact with them this year and meet them and stuff. And a lot of that couldn't have been done without you guys. Like, for those of you who joined, like, my group orders initially and, like, some friends that I've made in the community who've also helped me get into calls. Like, I, I'm very... And my mom just sneezed. <laughs> I'm very grateful, so... I just wanted to say, um, anyone who helped me on my Levolution collection, for example, very grateful. So, yeah, I don't know, I'm kind of tired, so I just, I feel like this is coming off very awkward, but I do mean it sincerely, so I hope you can understand. Um, but yeah, these are just the cards I have for this page, but I do have this album fully completed. Um, I actually made a TikTok in a reel storing everything just for fun, but then I took it out after. So, yeah. Um, and then for this page, I just have Dahyun. I love this card. Oh my gosh, it's raining. Um, and then the last two cards I have today are I have Sohyun Money Sticker and Yubin. I'm so excited though to officially store this arrow like in my binder and have it completed because I literally just need to work on Acid Angel from Asia and Evolution um, because I I swear I have one of these Yuyans. Let me check really quick actually. I can do that. Also, I have um I don't remember what I think I have one of hers on the way too. I don't know which one it is. I'm literally just missing though one hidden. I'm missing Hidden's card with the, the headphones. And then I'm missing um Kilama. Let's see what's in here. Um Okay. I have girl. Okay, I have this Yuan. Yeah. Okay, it was just oh shit, fuck, fuck. I'm dropping Jinsel and Human on the ground. Okay. But yeah, I have this Yuyan already. And then I have one of these hiddens, don't know which one. Okay. But yeah. But yeah, I went on the way. But oh my gosh, this collection. I'm just missing one, two, three, four, five, six cards for Acid Angel from Asia once I get whatever hidden. It's either this one or this one, I don't know. So yeah, I'm not missing that much. And then I literally just have to work on Evolution and then I'll be fully caught up OT24 or currently OT16. Um, but yeah, let's just a little flip through. I'm obsessed with my Triple S collection, so yeah, I gotta flip through. Also, I saw like Lola. Mama. I saw like some people who like started collecting trip us on YouTube too. Um, and a lot of people complain about this little like notches, like the little bars on the side. Personally though, I actually love the, um, the little bars on the side. Not gonna lie, I think they're so cute. Um, I could just be like heavily biased though. But I always liked these even before I was like officially like a Swiss at the time. So yeah. We have this page, which is so sad. It's literally just even. 
Assemble, which is like my favorite album. Absolutely love it. Poured that hand on the back. And once again, and then we have Feeling of Crystal Eyes. And Levolution. Why is this hidden like so? Okay. And then we have the stickers, which I might take these out. I don't know. Just because Evolution doesn't have them. So, yeah. Um, and then my cat. And then we have Evolution, which I don't know what I have on hand yet because I haven't gotten anything yet. So, yeah. But once again, we'll be collecting OT8. Okay. Thank you guys so much if you watched, if you made it this far. I always forget to mention, but all my supplies are linked in the description down below. And nothing is affiliate, so just so you know. Um, but if you would like to follow me on Instagram, you can. Here are both my Instagrams. The top one is DNWM Teddy. This is my trading, sales, and like group order account. So if you want to trade with me or buy from me or whatever, you can up here. And then down here, as one Cosmos is like my collection account where I post like my reels as well as like um, just collection posts, I guess. Um, also, my TikTok is one Cosmos. I post like fan call clips there on like random unboxings or whatever. So yeah, I think that's everything though. Um... But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you did, thank you. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye, babies!